Time to play with some clay. Well, I got about a half hour to work now. Yeah, about a half hour. <laughs> it's been a long, busy day today. But I shall overcome. Let me see. I've got to get the right flipping tool. There we go. I'm about ready to put this face back on. But I get to get this eye ready. It's not quite there. Then I get the nose to fix. Too much. You really got to judge the clay, the amount of clay that you use. By the way, you can tell how big this face is when you compare it to the head of a black uh, drywall screw. I've gotten a lot of comments about how hard it is for some people to do eyes. It never has been easy for me either. But it just takes patience and lots of hours of making eyes. It, it doesn't come easy, but you can do it. You just have to have the patience of Job. I'm going to make sure that the light hits the eyes exactly the same on both sides. That neither eye is a little lower or higher than the other. Okay, I'm going to. The last, yeah, see, I keep hitting the end of that nose. Use some lighter fluid to smooth off the face. By the way, I'd like to ask you a favor. A favor of you. If you like my videos, click the like button. And uh, please consider 
subscribing and clicking the little bell so you can get updates of my videos. That would really be nice. I'd love to have more people see my videos and and I think all that helps to do that but I'm not certain on that either. But if you would, I would really appreciate it. Okay. I'm going to let that dry. Let's see if I can't take off the face of the uh, warrior. All right, now I got to figure out how I'm going to cut this head off without screwing the whole thing up. I don't need my magnifiers for that. I do need a flame. To heat up my exacto knife. Cut back behind the front of the hair a little bit. <sighs> Let's see, it says fits first. This is where you can get really discouraged if you don't have patience. And it's best not to give up. Just try. And I cut back even further. Now I'm getting into the uh, armature. Okay, the face looks more natural now. I had to put his face up just a little bit because with an overhead light, his face won't show. It'll be just shadow. And uh, like I said, I've still got work to do on the face, but now I can see what it's going to look like in the uh, overall.
Oh, it really takes getting the right tool to do what you want it to do. And I've got to either take this eye back or bring that eye up. That's why you really need it on the uh, clay, so you can see how the light hits it. All right, I'm going to have to come back tomorrow and work on this. I'm just... A little stressed right now, so it's best to get the stress out of me and come back fresh tomorrow. Good night, everybody, and I'll see you next time. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs, uh, the link down below this video. All right, see you next time.